frozen fortress. Unlike anything Edmonton has ever seen. Yeah, the whole city should look like this. <laughs> the ice castle in Horlack Park is now open. It's so beautiful here. Edmontonians lined up on the first afternoon to take in our city's newest winter attraction. Yeah, I didn't know what to expect really, but it's awesome. Yeah, it's really cool. Uh, it's like walking into a different world. Stepping inside to explore the Narnia-like display, you will find a maze, tunnels, and ice formations resembling glacial caves. <laughs> a frozen slide. Waterfalls and fountains. I kind of thought oh, it was going to be a little shack, but it's got so much texture to put in it. And a light display for those who want to explore at night. The entire place glows from within, so it's pretty neat. The frozen structure stands 20 feet tall and spans an acre. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Yeah, yeah, it's very cool. Better than expected. <laughs> yeah. Did I expect yeah. the, the waterfall, the music, the lights? Whoever the artists were, it was pretty creative, you know? Dozens of workers began preparing for this back in October, laying down sprinkler lines to begin making icicles. Starting earlier this month, they began using the lines to make ice, making about 10,000 icicles a day to form the structure. It'll continue to change. Uh, we'll continue to build on certain areas. Um, as long as it's cold, we like to play. The opening also marks the Canadian debut for the American company, partnering with the City of Edmonton and the Silver Skate Festival. It's pretty magical. Whether you like winter or not, this new outdoor attraction is bringing Edmontonians together. We're very excited to have this in Edmonton.